How's it going? Uh, a couple of videos back, I said, Ooh, I wouldn't be surprised to see the House of Commons closing. And it is. Just like when they go for their summer break. Eh? In Canada, that's when usually the dirtiest, dirtiest deals are done before they're gone. Pew. Oh, it's Friday the 13th. Was it official closing today? Today was, was today their last day? Oh, I wonder what stuff uh, got snuck through. Um, if you don't watch Rob Hay, I've brought him up a few times. He's a small channel, but he has interesting facts. And uh, he has a, put up a video a little while ago about uh, what's on the parliamentary session. On this session, uh, some laws that are coming. Oh, some legislation that's tabled. It's... Uh, hideous man and what's more hideous is probably only people like us that are uh, fucking political junkies will watch it and go how can they be doing that <laughs> well not me i know how they're doing that but a few others know rob knows why they're doing that too so there you go uh, i'd go watch if, if, you, if you're interested in that go ahead so we're not gonna have a government running now and as we all know the border's still open Wee 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 wee. Where Congo has that, and those people are still coming across. Sh -sh 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 -sh. Come on in. I don't even know this clown country that's Canada. Justin Trudeau is stashed away in his bat cave. You know, probably. Excuse me, probably has lots of lots of weed, lots of rum. That's what he drinks. So he's stocked up. You know, and the Trudeaus only drink bottled glass bottled Perrier water. Right? I think a lot of people forgot about that. So I'm sure they're doing pretty good. Uh, you know, <laughs> America's uh, on a verge of state, uh, state of emergency declared it. So I guess that means the Canadian border will be closed. Would, will that mean they'll still get to run across at Roxham Road? Well, I guess that's going to probably slow down, isn't it? Or do they still get to come from Africa? If they're flying from Europe, no. That's kind of a good thing. They're not going to get to go to America, so it'll probably slow that down a trickle. Well, I guess we'll see what's going to come with that, eh? That's just uh, fucked up, man. Okay, so that was a fun stream for a while today. It was fun for me. <laughs> I, like, I like burning straw men down. Um, for those that expressed interest in what I'm, what's going on here this summer, like Justin Crange, Clemicious, you have to go pick up Phoenix. If uh, you're interested in that, dude, no problem. Get in touch with me for real when it gets closer. Yeah, you can bring your firearms. i got a range in the back, uh, all that stuff. It's going to be a big weekend. There will probably be a lot of people here, man. If you come with a tent or trailer, psh, you're welcome to put it up in here. Um, we'll have a big tent in the yard um, in case it rains. Uh, we'll probably have another bouncy castle again. <laughs> it's fun, that thing. <laughs> it is fun, man. So the, the guy down the road has one that rents one out, eh? So we'll probably have that. It'll be lots of stuff for kids to do because there'll be a pile of kids, all kinds of uh, um, Icelanders running all over the place, man. So, you know, dogs, quads, mini bikes. <laughs> There'll be something for everybody. Uh, I'll have games for kids to do uh, and games for adults to do because there's Icelanders here and stuff. So there'll be uh, some test of strength things, you know. See who can lift a full stetker. <laughs> I got one here. I, I must admit, I can't lift it anymore these days. I have to roll that one around. But I'm sure some uh, people that are coming will be able to lift that one. And that'd be awesome if you guys, some of you guys like that, you, you'd be more than welcome. More than welcome. You know, there's a great beach. Uh, I'd show you the good one to go to. 15 minutes away is Lake Winnipeg. I'd show you where the good beach to go. Uh, in summertime, there's lots of touristy stuff to do because it's a cottage area because of the beach. So there's all kinds of stuff to do in, the, in that town, Gimli, by the lake there. And Winnipeg Beach, um, just tons of stuff, man. So it's going to be a great weekend. It'd be just awesome if, uh, if, uh, if a couple of you guys came. It'd be great. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, all that stuff.